Hello guys, this is Dr. T and today let's continue the uh, the main quest uh, chapter 4 self for flesh wound so the last time uh, we found that uh, the father is already dead and you know how old has run off to mourn his loss so yeah it changes everything for him so let's go Archer, where is Humboldt? I tried to console him, but he pushed me away. I love the boy, I do. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road. To the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. Hmm, I'm sorry for his loss. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm very curious about who did this. What devil put you up to all this deception? I wasn't put up, Eivor. I felt compelled to carry on for the good of the Shire. Until I knew the truth. A pretty answer for an ugly lie. Hmm. I never believe everyone reading this stuff. Alright. Let's go. It's going to be a long way. Hmm, old tall tree. Where is that tree? Is this a right way? Oh, God, I'm so man. I've never heard of a Hoonwald. I can't even properly say the name. Is it Hoonwald? Oh, I'm sorry, man. <laughs> I don't have to time to help you. So hmm. this way. Shouldn't be seen here. The hood should work. The lazy will. Soon it will guide me. There, ah, uh, that is the old tall tree. Hmm. And hmm, there is a horse. So I think there must be someone. These woods, father. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. these woods. I remember the days we spent here together. Here upon this. <laughs> Hello? Eivor? Is that you? I'm sorry for Eivor, you, what a pleasant surprise. Would you drink with me? Humboldt. Come, s sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate... 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 The view. Beautiful. Hmm. Uh, I think this time is. Uh, don't do. You know, push hard. Just drink it together. This is the best way, I think. Let's have a drink. In the memory of your father. Sailing among the leaves so green. Do not gorge on grief, nor give in to sadness, but let your aching love 
light the meat of your eyes, and lead you to triumph. That is quite lovely. My father would have liked you. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting. And I would catch the m most wretched little things, if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. That's a good father. A toast. To your father, Lord Hunbeoth of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death, but in life he was as stalwart as this tree. A wise old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. <laughs> and then, and then my father says, it's the right goat, but it's the wrong end. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, my Swanborough loves that one. <laughs> she has a great sense of humor, my lady love. Father would have liked her. Right, your Dane lady love. She sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her we should go to brimsky uh, uh, grimsby yes yes there's no time to lose after you hmm he has a girlfriend nothing like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away and the contents of your gut what is this Now come, and enjoy the splendor of my Shire. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You've never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords, like a giant's axe wound. Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter. Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels. That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendor... ...full... Why come to England at all? Ah, uh, you can't grow crops on a blanket of jewels. Ha! <laughs> Very true. I'll admit, your countryside does take the breath away. Quite so, quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect her. I know many think me foolish, inexperienced. But I would ask that they judge me by my future hopes, not my past reputation. If That's I am right. given sway over this land and show myself to be a poor leader, shame me, punish me, of course. But give me that chance. My God, I just want to have that chance. Hmm. You definitely want to have a chance. Get the great reader. I what like that? that song. Birds, man. Eivor. Has no one told them today is a day of grief? Squad. There is someone. Who is Stop that? here. Something isn't right. I'll find the trouble before it finds us. Eivor, hmm. I am sweating from pit to toe. Do not leave me here. Hush. Stay calm. Whoa. I don't fight, Hunwald. Now! No arrows. Interesting. 
Boys. Why are you just standing there, man? Alright. Well struck, Eivor! That's twice they've tried to kill you, Hunwald. And twice failed! We had luck. But if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead. And yeah, they'll kill someone. anyone in the way to see it done. Yes, including my dear Swanborough, my lady love. Come, let us hurry away. I'm serious, Hunvald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me. <laughs> Hunvald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. I can do nothing without my darling lady. You've made me realize how much I've neglected her through this fatal stupor of mine. This I must see for myself. I got a bad feeling about this. Mm. You can use your horse. Where is that? <laughs> there seems there doesn't seem to be a enemy. Hmm. You can use your horse. Doesn't listen to me. Oh, this is the village. Oh. Where is it? The house? Oh, thank the heavens! There she is! Where is she? This lady. Oh, she seems sad. Hendval, I thought for sure you'd be dead. Why didn't you send word? It has been far too long, my little jewel. I'm so very sorry for that. I'm fine, my love. I wilted without you, but still I grow. And who is this? Ah, yes. I am proud to present Eivor of the Raven Clan. Hello, Eivor. A pleasure to meet you. Hmm. And you, Swanborough. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories, yet here you are. Surprised to find a Dane by his side? Not quite. I'm surprised to find a Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? 
My father is dead. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. Then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunvald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A shire mood will soon be held. Hunvald should stay here, out of sight, until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. Hunvald, no. The Shire must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's footsteps and lead the Shire as he did. Hmm. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the Shire moot, it's you, my dear. Come inside and rest your bumbling bones, love. Be well, Eivor, and thank you. Hmm. That's a better way. Keep watch over that one. Men have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I don't doubt it. She got a bows. That's why. Looks hard, big ass. Alright, so thank you for watching my channel, guys. And see you at the next videos. Bye bye.